Alright, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K22. Man, we got a whole lot of stuff to talk about today, man. We got wages, we got power DF. You know, talk, saying some things, a few things, asking some questions and all that good stuff, man. We got Ronnie 2K popping off. And last but not least, man, I got, you know, hey, I got the headphones on. So I'm going to let you guys stew and, and, and kind of figure out, you know, you know what I'm talking about? Kind of figure out what that means and all that stuff, man. But if I got the headphones on, you already know something special is happening, man. So if you don't do nothing else, make sure y'all like the video, man. Because every time you like the video, that helps us get to that oh-so-coveted 100K. Like, I, I, I keep saying this stuff, man. Like, there's staples in the community and stuff. And we're going to talk about that later on. But... What I want y'all to do, man, make sure y'all like the video. Let's get to that 100K, man. It's been about 13 years, man. It's been a long time, so we trying to get there, man. And without further ado, let's just get right into the news. Bye! Hey, man, check it out, man. Ooh, look at this right here, man. Look, right here, we got this right here, this hashtag assist gang, all this stuff, man. Look, check this out. We got the anonymous mask. I got it here for a reason. The logo show in approximately 24 hours follow for all of the latest who gets the final vouch who gets that final vouch all that good stuff man you got all these other people up here vouching all this good stuff they want people to get the you know get the logo and stuff like that um i mean i feel like the logo honestly should be for streamers and people that actually make content and stuff like that so i mean hey it's probably some people that shouldn't but there's nobody out there that makes more content or streams more than my boy anonymous 2k tv hashtag assist game you like team working defense you'll love my channel exclamation point new yt for the latest video man look look we got the anonymous mask is on out here man and all that good stuff man and i know y'all gonna ask me in the comment section and all that uh, uh, jay how did you get the how did you get the anonymous mask now i'm not saying y'all should go put on the mask because i don't know if you on everybody running around with it on ain't like he can stop us but we just showing support i'm a fan hey look i even got on i even got on the assist gang original assist gang shirt that we made three years ago so you know what i'm talking about. i know i'm a fan he definitely needs to get that 25 2500 wins bro ain't nobody got more wins than anonymous and all that good stuff so listen man if y'all do nothing else y'all vouch for anonymous tell him that he needs this stuff man like i said hashtag assist gang do i not got the drippiest anonymous face and you can get it too man uh, check this out. This is how I get it, man. There's a, um, there's a, there's a joint on here, uh, page on here. It's called NBA 2K Face Plug or whatever. The link will be down in the description. Pretty much what you do is you go and you, uh, you, you get your, you know, you do the face scan, you hold it up to it and you can actually scan this. This is actually scannable on your screen. So you can scan that. And they got so many other, like when you see everybody with all the little, you know, the little face scans and stuff, bro, this is where they're getting them from. They got some of everything, man. So, you know, I got, I got my, uh, my face scan from them. Uh, came out perfectly. They even got the white walk. I might, I might make make that right there. Uh, they got that young Mike Jack. Everything, man. They got pretty much everything. They got that all black one gun man, John Wick, bad man. I tried this one right here, the Squid Games. It was a little bit of a fail for me, but it didn't work out for me. But like I said, man, that's why I got my anonymous face scan, and that's where you can get all the other face scans. So I know a lot of people want to will probably ask that. So uh, that's the answer to that question. Up next, we got your boy Power DF with a tweet hey this is i just thought this was funny that's all i just thought it was funny hey my win percentage is only bad because i play with randoms and irls and get error coded every game i'm actually good you know what this is one of them things where that does happen to a lot of people honestly but in 2k 16 was it what was the 2k where everybody was like man i just been letting my little cousin play man he been losing a lot of games with me that's my more they like people used to that was what, that's what used to people people used to say all the time in 2k 16 so it was always one of them things where it was like it was always something now i'm not gonna lie to you this dude right here Pudo, i don't even know what his win percentage is don't much care but i know he's one of the best players i've ever played with period because and he said he played with his homeboys and brother IRS and all that didn't check his win percentage didn't care about none of that I have not lost a game with Pooh Dog except for one that I completely threw I completely threw it I launched it but I ain't lost no games with Pooh Dog man this dude is tough so I went while win percentage ain't everything it is part of the actual equation or whatever like that man so you know it I, I get why people look at it but you see why people like me brute and all of us we don't uh, we don't really look at it. Uh, 
Uh, up next, man, we got nah, ain't no, ain't no waving. Bree, Breezy in the background. Look at the fresh, bre them, 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 them. Oh, I saw, I saw you wash your hair this morning. No. Oh, I thought you did. It was looking quite, quite spiffy this morning. Uh, I got, I got to hide all that ass in the background. Check. She, she trying to sit in her chair. But anyway, uh, Power D up also says W Wage is GG to speed. Um, who was there? Even though it took forever, I guess they had a little wager last night and all that good stuff, man. So, uh, you know, the wager went good. I suppose he showed the little screenshot with speed paid up and everything like that, man. So uh, that that went quite well for them. But that's all the news that we have for you all today. But we do have an extra, extra, extra something here, man. We got uh, that's that's the news, but we got an extra discussion piece for y'all today, man. I got my guy. Man, man, grind the fuck hard, man. Man, 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 tell, tell, tell them boys what's happening, man. Tell them what's happening. We got something special for the people. I told y'all I got on the headphones today. It had to be something special. Tell them what's up, man. What's up? All right, what's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? Man, tell them who you is, man. Look, you don't have to tell nobody who you are because your body is known in the community. Everybody knows who Man Man Grind Hard is. If if not through my channel, through through just your channel. Hell, they probably know me through you because you know what I'm talking about. But but <clears throat> you know, a staple in the community. All that good stuff, man. Uh, what what are we talking about today, man? Tell tell them what 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 topic we got for the people today. Uh, I've been playing 2K for like the last four hours, and the only thing I can <laughs> think of is this shit ain't for casual <laughs> players. All right. Would you would you mind would you care to elaborate on that? It ain't it ain't for casuals. Bro, you can't just buy 2K and just go play it. <laughs> That's true. Like you can't. Like they they didn't make the game for you to be able to go do that, right? And that's what these motherfuckers are trying to do, bro. <laughs> no, so they, so what you're saying is, uh, let me I'm, I'm gonna try to clarify for the people a little bit. So what you're saying is, if uh, most games that are casual, you can just buy the game, pick it up, play it. You don't have to do a whole lot. You just you you know what I'm saying. You just buy, pick it up, play it, and you can go forth and you can be pretty much successful in the game, or uh, whatever. But in this game. You're gonna have to make some type of investment, whether that be a VC investment, a time investment to grind your player. You got to get your badges right, stuff like that. That's what you're trying to kind of trying to say, bro. That's exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> not to mention, hold on, hold on. Not only is it not for just the casual player, mm -hmm. but this is the issue that I have with it, right? What's that? Since since it's not for the casuals, right? Right. Nine times out of ten, if you don't know how to do some shit, what you do go to fucking YouTube. That's true. But if you go to YouTube, it's not really teaching casual players shit. Not That's true. the top video that you're going to see. That is correct. It's just going to teach you a bunch of bullshit. And, you know, that's why we got five, seven toddlers playing against <laughs> grown, you know what I'm saying? Six, five motherfucking <laughs> point guards out here. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, but they, but they find it. But some of those five, five, seven toddlers finding some success, though, man. Like as as my boy would call them, Cubs finding some success right now with the left, right, man. How you feel about that, man? If they break, if they patch left, right, they break the whole game, bro. Ooh, but but they haven't been okay. So so me being devil's advocate, they haven't been able to they haven't been able to do nothing about left, right since two K sixteen when they made it where if you went left, right, left, right, left, right, and then you tried to take a shot, it would say bad shot selection, and you just automatically missed the shot. That was the last time they actually tried to or were able to do something about it. Uh, you know, but uh, ever since then, left, right has been prevalent in the community. Now I would say that there's been a lot of other dribble moves. And left, right wasn't as effective because you actually had to time your shot, especially last year. You had to time your shot uh, depending on where you were on the court and, and what type of shots you was taking and what moves you were coming off. But now, if you wide open, you're pretty much going to hit the shot as long as you got muscle memory, man. You, you think that's uh that's uh helping out the, the five sevens a little bit or whatever? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's like what I said. If they if they patch it, they break, they break the game. Yep. And the reason I say that, because look, like you said, 2K16, they put it in. I didn't have a problem with it. Like, if you debated niggas on what was the best 2K, some right. would say 2K16 in terms of defense and what you could do on that game. Right. But they had that in the game. Yeah. And if people liked it and they haven't put it in the game and people liked it, then I, I, I would assume that me that they can't or it, it would be an issue of just implementing left, right. You know what I'm saying? You miss a shot without breaking some other mechanics. Right, but I, I don't know. That's just me thinking. Loud to two K might be looking at this shit like, no, no. I like people going left, right, left. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> I, I don't know, bro. Shit, yeah. We don't know. 
that's that's true. Why? We don't, you know, I, I, I think know. I think the biggest part of it is that it's a bad, it's a game first of all, I guess, and and so we know it's not gonna be realistic. You're not gonna hit all your shots. You're not gonna do all that good stuff right there. We, I mean, you you're not gonna miss. You're not gonna. Nobody will be happy with shooting forty percent, right? Um, at the at the beginning of the game. They did have it kind of balanced out where, and I know you said you didn't play at the beginning of the game because we were talking about this earlier. At the beginning of the game, it was kind, it was somewhat balanced, but it might have been over, overly slanted toward the defense because if you put that ball in somebody's face at the beginning of this game, when it first came out, they were taking it. It was gone. Then they buffed unpluckable and unpluckable on goal. It's nearly impossible to take the ball from somebody unless they make an egregious mistake. But at the same time, you got, you got. Um, Current gen, which is the the gameplay that we got in the background. Current gen, every everybody can get unpluckable on goal, so you're definitely not taking the ball from anybody on current. So I think that that went a long way to promote this type of gameplay. But we told them that if y'all if y'all make it so we can't steal the ball anymore, really more or less, or, or if they tone it down, they overbalance it. I guess we would say if they do that, then it's gonna be a real issue because. Nobody's gonna be able to take the ball from nobody, and 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 uh, you know you're gonna have a whole bunch of BS out here, and that's why we got the five seven. The five sevens did not get born until that happened, because they would have been a complete liability. I mean, but the easy fix to that is okay. If I got space between me and my defender, mm. he shouldn't be able to take the ball. Rather, it don't matter what he got on his pickpocket. If right. I got space, if right. I got space, keyword space. But if I'm dribbling up on you and I got unpluckable on, mm -hmm. right? And I'm like, literally, there's no space between me. He should not be able to ever dribble the ball. Right. And see me. It don't matter you, what badge he got on. Right. And you and I agree with that. But a lot of people did not like that. They, they, they felt like, now I did, I did say that there were some unrealistic launches that would happen that you would get here and there and all that good stuff. That did happen, but. Uh, I was like, if they just take those things out of the game, tone those things down, then we should be good. But instead of doing that, they just buffed unpluckable, and you just cannot, you cannot take the ball from anybody, damn near. That's just where we are with it. And so, and like I said, unless they make a, a, a crazy mistake. But like I said, you and I, we agree on that part. Hey, if there's sufficient space between you and I, you shouldn't be able to take the ball. But I yeah. should never be able to just run through your chest with the ball, just. You know what I'm saying? I'm literally dribbling the ball off your chest, but the dude can't take it. And and even more than that, if he reaches, he's dead. So so even though it's tempting for me to reach to try to take the ball from you, if I reach, you're just gonna sprint the other direction and it's and it's and it's money. So, you know. That's where we okay, at, I'll man. Say this. Can What's we that? can all right, can we agree on this? What Regardless we? of what we we saying and the issues is. Right. I say 2K in a good place. If 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 what we're saying right now is bro, just find the balance in between. Yeah. Pickpocket mm -hmm. and unpluckable. Right. Bro, this game is dead. You see what I'm saying? Cause I then agree. It, it it take away these fucking um infants, um toddlers, adolescents running around the goddamn court against grown men. You see what I'm saying? Like right. they can't do that if 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 I get in that shit, which I'm supposed to be able to, bro, I'm six five, bro. Right. If if my if my dude is six five and you five seven, bro, you should not be able to do nothing but run. If I get in your shit, bro, I, that ball's supposed to come out. Right. Regardless, Somebody. bro. Regardless. Right. The the skill gap is supposed to be, bro, keeping that space. So exactly. you're not getting in my shit. Right. That's supposed to be the skill gap, bro. It's a bailout. Right. But, I mean, I, I agree with shit. that, and and I I, I I feel like being able to maintain that space between you and your defender, because that's that's realistic. But we can't compare it to real life, because if we say it ain't real life, we know we know shooting percent. Okay, we know that, but being able to maintain that space should be. It's just like a shooter needing to know how much how to maintain that space so he can get his shot off. I feel like a dribbler need to know how to maintain that space so that they can dribble the basketball without getting it stolen. But they don't want to do that and they cried and 2K caved and this is why we got the game that we got now. Now, like you said, I still feel like the game is in a good space. You can you can get plenty of bumps on these guys. You can wear their uh you can wear their that stamina down and you can make them take a bad shot because once your stamina goes below a certain point, your shot gets dirt slow. You're not hitting the shot more or less. But yeah. at, but so if you can wear them down, if Bruiser was back in the game, I would say hey, everything's fair because not only with Bruiser, you remember 2K20 
with Bruiser, with, with Bruiser in 2K. Anyway, in 2K20, you can lean on people and your stamina went down so bad that if the game was 18 to 18, you might not even have your Gatorade bar no more. Like you was literally at half stamina. I feel like that would be a fair trade off if they did it like that to where your stamina depleted at a much greater rate. Cause like in 2K, in 2K8, in 2K20, you couldn't play lockdown uh, you couldn't play on the ball unless you had, you know, if you had a two -way, the two-way slash and play, yeah, you could do it because they, that was a glitch bill. But um, it had like super 99 stamina. But most bills, they could not dribble the ball and play defense. If you played defense, you had to, um, you know, you wouldn't have enough energy to play offense. If they did something like that with this game, I think that'll make it completely fair because, because then, you know, stamina being such a big part of be, people being able to take a shot, if they couldn't, if you could wear down their uh, stamina, then you know over the course of the game you'll be good, and we can, and then you could you could also equalize it by being able to, to attack those guys on offense. I keep going back down, you I keep doing stuff like that. You you using some stamina, so by the end of the game your shot is not what it used to be. It's gonna be much slower. You probably can't get it off. You probably can't even time it. I think that would be a good way to since you're gonna take unpluckable away. We can balance it with stamina. Just let the stamina deplete in a 2K 20ish type of way. You can't do 9,000 dribble moves at the end. I don't know. Yeah. That might be overreaching, though. I don't know, man. But Bro, this is the last thing I'm going to say because I just thought about it in terms of like five sevens, bro. Mm -hmm. I remember in 2K15, I don't know if, if dude still got it on his channel, but Pretty Boy Fredo uploaded a video. At the time, he was making like a 5'10 guard. Right. And that was smaller than any other guards that was playing 2K at the time. Mm -hmm. And I remember coming on that video saying like, bro, if I don't think it's a good idea to tell niggas to make this type of build because that would like fuck up the game if everybody running around with little ass bills like that, bro. Correct. This, this was in 2000 and this was 2K. I think it was 15. It was either 15 or uh, 16. Might have been. It might have been 16 because then everybody ended up making that six foot guy that could uh dunk shoot and do all that stuff so yeah it might have yeah. been 16. because long Bruce, story Bruce short made bro, one. it's the same it's the same thing bro yeah. like this year yeah it's youtube it's like what i said in the beginning bro like the casuals don't know the real if anybody buy 2k nobody never stinks to make a five seven guard that's if true I'm a, if i'm gonna play this game bro and, I, and i'm never looking at nothing else I, I i would never think to make the smallest possible fucking bill. I right. just wouldn't waste no money on that shit. Correct. But if I go to YouTube as a casual and I see, oh, this is the most dominant way to play in the fucking game, and that video got more views than everything else, why would I go look at the nigga that got 2,000 views versus the nigga that got goddamn 3,000 views telling me to do yep. this shit versus this nigga that got 2,000 as a can Right. And I, and I could agree with that. Yeah, and a lot of other people too, they said, like I had one guy in the comment section yesterday, he said, look, I, I just feel happy I can make that 5'7 because you know I wanted to make it all 5'9, 5'10 because I like to make my real build in the game and my real build is actually viable. So that's the, that's a flip side to it, I guess. Like he wanted to make a 5'10, 5'11 and he actually be viable. That's cool. Like, you know, so I guess that part is cool for a lot of people to be able to do. But at the same time, like you said, the it, it, it could be like it's just not for casuals anymore like yes casuals play the game and yes casuals can have a lot of fun and success but but what he's saying is like if you want to it, it's just it's so much information out there now and so many people looking to break the game on youtube and stuff like that that if you're a casual you're probably gonna get swallowed up and and not have the most fun time you can't just come out here with the two with with with, with, with multi-position to defend and stuff like that you can't just be like you're gonna have to invest some time whether it be looking in bills you gonna have to invest some time whether in getting your bill right some vc whatever it is you're gonna have to do that you can't just be casual with it anymore and then the flip side like you said earlier everybody in the community swear they're a content creator so that's the other flip side to it so everybody's looking to drop the next person off for it like you it ain't just no casual play no more kind now it is because a lot of people do do that but like you know it's just different levels of different worlds of 2k and it, it just ends up being like that i think it's unfortunate i wish we could just go back to the days in 16 when people weren't running and everybody was playing everybody and everybody was just you know we just trying to have fun and nobody was it, nobody was afraid if i lose this video i'm gonna end up on youtube because it, it wasn't that type of atmosphere at that time but anyway man that's, that's all we got for y'all today man i just want to bring my boy man man grind hard on here have a little conversation if y'all like these type of videos what we do this right here man make sure y'all leave it a light say that it was lit it just need to be a little bit 
short or something like that. I don't know, man. We get to talking, then we get to talking. That's just how it go. But you know, we got a podcast coming, something like that later on. We just gotta get some get some good times. Or maybe we'll just do this like this, you know, morning on most mornings and have y'all be able to weigh in and chime in or something like that. We're gonna figure it out. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Let me know what y'all how y'all might wanna do it, or if you got some suggestions. We're gonna holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People Champ. It's little niggas online keep taking stabs at us, but I'm too stingy to even give half a fuck. Godspeed, Godspeed.